So to my returning subscribers, thank you very much for always tuning in. Thank you so much for your support always. I'm super, super grateful. Thank you. And to my new subscribers, hi, my name is Joy. I'm a YouTuber based in Abuja. If you've not subscribed yet, please do well to subscribe, like, comment, and share. So guys, join me make this very delicious Nigerian Ogbono soup for my husband. Yes, guys, you heard me right. I'm specially making this delicious Ninja soup for my darling husband. So guys, let's get started. So here is my dried and already blended Ogbono. I will set that aside and these are my protein. I'm using some smoked mackerel fish, the bone black fish and the bone panla fish. For the smoked mackerel fish, I smoked it myself and the video, I think the video is up. So please do well to check and see how I smoked it, okay? So I will set that aside. So next is my already cooked and dried beef and my stock fish is cooked as well. I'll just set that aside and this is my bitter leaf neatly washed. And this is my crayfish powder which is necessary. My pepper, I'm going to be using some fresh pepper as well. This is my salt and this is my bouillon cube which I'm going to set aside. So for my obono, I love to do this process with my obono soup. I don't miss this out. I don't do the direct entering. I love this process. I was groomed with this process. So I'll just combine this together. I think the oil was so much, but after um, combining everything, it's just balanced. So we were able to work with this. So when adding your oil, you have to be very careful and mindful okay so i'll combine well then set aside our ingredients for this recipe is almost ready we're not taking so much time so this is my cooked beef and my cooked um stock fish my pro just everything all the protein i need i will just go in with some fresh pepper some dried pepper my crayfish powder salt and my bouillon cube so i'll just combine everything together then go in with some hot water to quicken the cooking process so guys i'll be listing out the ingredient i used for this delicious obono soup in the description box so please do well to check okay So now I'm adding my mixed Ogbono. At this point, if you have your meat stock, you can go in with your meat stock. But if you don't have your meat stock, you can make use of water to loosen up. I don't like my Ogbono too thick or curling together. No, I don't like that. So I'll go in with a lot of water. I'm using hot water. I'm going with a lot of water to loosen up just for it to loosen up. So I'll just let it cook I'll cover this to cook for about two minutes once it's um, bubbling I'll open it because I don't want it to pour out so I'm standing just very close to it waiting for it to just like this so I'll just leave this open now to cook you don't want your opener pouring out once your opener start bubbling 
you don't have to cover it okay so what i'm adding now is my already washed bitter leaf guys if you know me well you know i love i love i love i love bitter leaf in my soup i don't joke with bitter leaf in my soup except it's not necessary okay so i love bitter leaf that's why i'm adding bitter leaf in my soup and i washed love to wash my bitter leaf myself because i have bitter leaf in my garden so i just plug and wash myself so guys i will just combine this and guys at this point the aroma coming out from my kitchen was calling this time it was not just calling my neighbor it was dragging my street people come on come on somebody is cooking in this house <laughs> So guys, what would you be pairing this delicious Ogbono soup with? For me, I love to pair mine with some semo. And would you be trying this recipe? Please try it and thank me later, okay? And guys, at this point, our delicious Ogbono soup is ready. So guys, thank you very much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share. Bye-bye.